Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Guys, today I'm checking out one of your recommendations. Guys, this is gonna be a lot of believers who does this after missing a prayer. By Mufti Merk. Guys, I told you before, I love him. Like, I love the way he teaches and I love the way he tries to explain things to people. Like, he makes it very, very important for you to connect with God personally. And this is something that I... I'm going through the journey on like I want to discover and connect with God personally. Now I feel he he's a great person in teaching this. Like he's one of the best I have seen. Guys, let's get straight into this. That Allah Almighty has blessed us beyond what we deserve. Allah has granted us beyond what we deserve. Allah says to us, if I had to punish people because of what wrong they've done. If I had to punish them immediately, they wouldn't even exist because that's not how Allah operates. Allah gives you a chance. He knows how he created you. He knows you personally. He knows your problems. He knows your issues, your struggles. He knows your strengths. He knows your weaknesses. He knows you're trying. And guess what? He's favored you. He's blessed you. He's granted you. He has honored you in so many ways. You just need to think about it in order to recognize a little bit. Do not let anyone make you feel that just because you're struggling a little bit with your faith, you're doomed and you're out of the circle. Not at all. Everyone's struggling in one way or another, different levels. Even the one who appears pious sometimes struggles with the timing of their prayers. Ask them if they're honest enough to admit yes. Sometimes they might even miss a prayer. The Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, at his time spoke about what to do when you miss the prayer. Do you know why? It happened to the best of people. It happened to the companions, some of them. So he says, The Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, says, Whoever has overslept, they've missed the prayer. Or whoever out of human forgetfulness, has missed the prayer. They should do it as soon as they remember. Wow. What does that mean? Alhamdulillah, it covers me. It covers you. It means you're a human being. It's possible you make a mistake. It's possible you forgot. It's possible you overslept. Allah says, we won't punish you. Rabbana la in nasina aw akhta'na. O Allah, O our Lord, don't hold us don't hold against us our forgetfulness or our error due to human nature. Even if I've overslept, I need to get up and I say, Astaghfirullah, la hawla wa la quwwata illa billah. Oh Allah, I seek your forgiveness. I've overslept. I made a mistake. I've missed my prayer, for example. But get up and do something about it. Guys, we've come to the end of the video, guys. And <coughs> one thing I noticed is that everyone, I feel... Most people might have missed the prayer and try very, very good for you to do it as soon as you like had the knowledge that I'm supposed to be doing this by this time and you just go straight and do it. And I love his explanation, but one thing I have a question about is why is it that like people still have to pray with Arabic? Like, can't you pray using English? I don't understand. I feel Arabic is a language of, okay, I feel it's a language that Abraham was, not Abraham, sorry, that Prophet Muhammad, that was the language they were speaking and that's why it was written in Arabic. So I feel based on time and the century we are in now, like English is one of the most commonly used language, like it's accepted worldwide so if maybe someone that does not know arabic is is it wrong for the person to just pray in english and like don't i'm not saying like i'm trying to say that is it by force you must actually change your language like not change your language per se but like learn arabic where you can read the Quran. there's an english translation and you can pray in English. Why is it that it's always going back to Arabic, like Arabic, Arabic? I need the explanation, guys. I think I'm going to watch. 
I think I'm going to react to a video about that. I need to. Guys, there's a like, share, subscribe to my channel. Tell me what you think about this video, guys. I'll see you next time, guys. Peace.